I now call on Director Dwayne Garris, Chair of the Honorary Members Committee, to deliver the committee's report. Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Mr. President. Serving with me on the 2014 Honorary Members Committee are Directors Jim Brown, Gilbert Gonzalez, Tina Rakes, and Lynn Underwood. International Code Policy establishes a process for nominating honorary member candidates for approval by the ICC membership. The Board of Directors establishes a committee to assist in developing nominations each year. Based on the committee's recommendations, the Board makes suggestions to the Code Council voting members for approval. Qualified candidates for the honorary member distinction have demonstrated service to the ICC or one of the legacy model code organizations. Honorary members have voting rights as described by the bylaws and all other regular member benefits. The committee and the ICC Board of Directors recommend the following for honorary membership. D. Sal D. Zimone. Sal wears many hats. He is the code official, fire commissioner, and floodplain manager for Avalon, New Jersey. He has been a volunteer firefighter during his entire adult life. He is a New Jersey certified subcode official and certified statewide and nationally as a floodplain manager. Sal is a past president of the New Jersey Building Officials Association. The association has named him Building Inspector of the Year in 2010. He is an active participant in the code development both for the state of New Jersey and the ICC. Robert, Robert Cohendike. Robert was and is retired. Um, he was a chief of the State of Michigan Department of Labor Plumbing Division. Robert served with the team that developed the joint model plumbing code that combined the plumbing uh, codes created by our legacy organizations. At the time, in addition to those three plumbing codes, most large jurisdictions had their own plumbing codes. The outcome of the initiative is what today we know as the International Plumbing Code. The IPC is currently used in 35 states, the District of Columbia, New York City, Guam, and Puerto Rico. George Martin. George is an engineer specialist at Howard County Government in Maryland. George has been involved in code compliance and code adoption for over 40 years and he has held every position on the Maryland Building Officials Association the Executive Board of Directors, is the past chair of the ICC Region 7, and has served on numerous ICC committees. George has been a mentor and a friend to many of those throughout the state, region, and nation. Jerome Jerry Sanzone. Jerry is a retired official from Pompano Beach, Florida. Jerry has supported and served ICC in many roles, including dedicating himself to actively participating in every annual conference since 1966. He was also active in code development as a Building Officials Association of Florida member and leader. He was instrumental in planning this year's conference. He can take much of the credit for its success. Unfortunately, he is not able to be with us this week. It is the very first conference he has missed since 1966. In appreciation and gratitude, we move to honor Jerry as an honorary member of the International Code Council. Jeff Whitney. Jeff is the building official for Grand County, Utah. He served the membership for two terms on the Board of Directors. Jeff is an active participant in code development, served on the CDP Access Committee, and was board liaison for the Global Membership Committee. He has been the Grand County Building Official for more than 20 years and holds 12 ICC certifications. He is a past president of the Utah chapter of the International Code Council, and Jeff is fondly and widely known for his sense of humor. Mr. President. <laughs> he called me mid-sip. <laughs> May I have a motion to ratify Sal D. Simone I need to finish. <laughs> and of course, it's a Jersey guy, right? Figures. Robert Coinendike, 
George Martin, Jerome Sanzone, and Jeff Whitney as International Code Council honorary members as nominated by the committee and the board of directors. Is there a second? Is there any discussion on the motion? All those in favor signify by saying aye. aye. Those opposed would not be smart enough to stand. The motion carries. Congratulations, one and all. is certainly an esteemed group. <clears throat> Thank you, Chairman Garris, the members of your honorary members committee for your service.